Good morning. Guess what? Guess what? Guess whose birthday it is? Yep, it is my birthday. Um, I woke up earlier. I'm actually on my way to Breakfast Club at the moment. I woke up um, earlier. My mum gave me this amazing present. I'll I'll show you when. I get home later I've also got a couple visitors coming I know it's like I'm working but like yeah so Sally's gonna come round and she's probably gonna leave when I have to leave back out for work yes I have to work on my birthday unfortunately but I got my contract so yeah um, and then tomorrow I'm going out with some friends we're gonna go to a really nice park there's really nice um, club and one of my friends is going to stay the night because she lives really far so she's just going to stay with me for the night and yeah that's pretty much it anyway so I'm going to go to work now and then afterwards I have to go to a library because guess what I am redoing I'm redoing my GCSEs at the moment so but this time I'm doing it via online because I have to work around work and also when I went to college I just felt like none of the tutors was actually teaching me anything so now I can sort of I'm responsible for basically my outcome so that's what I'm doing today also I do want to apologize for um, this posting so late like I've been posting really late and the reason why is because morning yeah the reason why is because um, we, we've been having some serious serious technical issues someone has like cut all the wires in our block trying to get someone to come fix it it's a nightmare no one seems to be bothered my mum's calling almost every other day just it's long so I don't know when you're gonna see this but today is the 8th of September 2023 and I am 30 anyway I'm coming up to my school uh, to the school so I have to shut you off but I will film afterwards sorry it wasn't filming before anyway hey guys i am home now i had a very long morning so i'm gonna let you know what happened so um obviously before i've by the way i've got the gifts that my mum um gave me it's over here anyway so but before i get into all of that let me just tell you about what happened and to be honest i forgot to record I'm really sorry about that. I mean, I did sort of like, I did want to record in the library, but when you turn on this camera, it makes this beeping sound that everybody knows that you turn on like a camera or something like that. I mean, like I could have turned it on before I came into the library, but I didn't think of that at the time. And where the library is so quiet, I just thought probably not. Anyway, so I went to go get my books um, there's only one book that I found and it was the wrong version I went I was just scouring through by the way there's some real interesting books in that library like there's some real good books in the library but um, I was just scouring through the book books anyway um, but actually I'm jumping ahead aren't I I'm doing that thing again <laughs> so <laughs> on my way to the bus stop after okay let me yeah <laughs> on the way um on the way home from work um sally let me know that she can't make it after all because her jobs her job center um her job center what are they called not you are instructor no whatever her job sent a person basically um sent her a message saying for her to come in and obviously it was our very awkward time our appointment's at 11 and by the time she gets down here afterwards it'll probably be like basically less than an hour before i had to leave so we sort of decided probably no point because she would come after if it wasn't for her children so I didn't want to stress her out, so I just thought, okay, 
you know and obviously life gets in the way I guess and things like that I done a deep clean last night but obviously it's not just um, Sally coming I've got another friend coming over tomorrow and she's staying so it's not just for that basically um, so yeah so on my way so and then I came home I came home because number one library don't open until library don't open until 10 number two I forgot my purse because my the my library card is actually inside my purse and the reason why is because I actually don't go to the library that often um I know like obviously I go to like the library near my workplace but that's only to fill in time but I mean like to take out books and things like that my very local library that's just up the road I don't go there that that often so I had it in another purse so I needed to come home anyway to get my purse in order to um, get my library card or like get my library card out of my purse and then um, Went down the road, got a Kit Kat, it's my birthday, I can have chocolate on my birthday. Anyway, so I got a Kit Kat Crunchy, um, and then I got a Kit Kat Crunchy, and then I was literally just, I was literally just um, looking through the books, just to see if I could find anything. Sally called me as well, I was just talking, and then, yeah, I just couldn't find any books that's, Basically, I just couldn't find any of the books. Um, I mean, I found To Kill a Mock... No, I found two of the books. I found two books. So I found Macbeth and To Kill a Mockingbird, but it's not the right versions. So I'm going to have to... <sighs> zip into my savings and buy the books. They could have been free had they been there, but anyway, so then after that, I just came home, pretty much. <laughs> By the way, it's um, Friday today, and I am so happy, I'm so happy it's Friday, I'm tired, I'm tired, I'm tired, I'm tired, but we still got stuff to do. So let me show you what my mother and my mum, bless her, because obviously like I do most of my practices like either in my room where I don't really announce like oh I'm doing a tarot reading or I'm doing a A, B or C. So to other people they probably think I'm still not, I'm not really into that anymore but I really am. So she was like really panicking, thinking, okay, you know, like maybe she's like not into that anymore. Maybe it was just a phase, but no, it wasn't. I just don't announce it. Anyway, um, so first off, uh, my mum bought me this jumper. I mean, like it's supposed to be, it's supposed to be a jumper, but when it came, it seemed more like a pajama top. She mentioned that also, so. I said so we both said yeah it'll be it'll come in really handy for the winter because it is thick and it says yes I'm cold <laughs> so um, it's funny but um because I'm always cold so I'll have this as like a nice pajama top obviously not for now it's scorching hot anyway I'll turn it this way for the suspense. Mm -hmm. My mum bought me uh, these bangles, and there's a um, like these chakra um, bangles. This one and this one. I think what's really sweet about I'll say up for after. My mum bought me this necklace, which I will wear today like a Virgo necklace. I'm gonna w definitely wear this today. Uh, my mum bought me this ring and on the ring it's got like a little stone. Um, I think that's a quartz. I'm not too sure. But yeah. 
She got me, um, my mum got me, where is it from? Yeah, my mum got me um, these, which I'm, I mean, like, I'm still on my craft, so, and I'm still learning, you're always learning, so, with these, I'm not too sure what these are for, but I will definitely research, they do look like they're important for something, and then it comes with this, so I think this could be for, um, a pendulum thing maybe like a pendulum thing maybe because if it comes together maybe i don't know but uh, uh, either way i really like that my mom got me this um it's a very it looks very similar to my virgo one well, um, well, the same design, but I'm not too sure. I think this may be another thing. I'm not too sure, but it's pretty anyway. I don't think it's Virgo, though, but it is pretty anyway. And then, and that, she got me another, um, another... There's chakra bangle, <laughs> another chakra bangle. Yeah. And then this has to be one of my favorites. It's almost like a um, protection bottle, like a spiritual bottle or like a spa gel sort of, uh, I mean not spa gel. <laughs> Uh, um, spell jar thing because it's like a moon and it's got all these different crystals inside I think this looks really pretty I think that looks really pretty another um, chakra bangle <laughs> bless her She got me this necklace, it's like, it's Africa, I think it looks, re it's really pretty. It's really pretty. So that's nice to wear like, I don't know, like maybe like on a night out or something. And she got me, is this pouch and it's got all these, um, so I can see um, tiger eye, quartz, citron. I have to read what that other one is, but it's really nice. So it's all, all of those. And then she got me this cute little box is really cute i do like it and inside the box there's more stones which they look they all look so pretty And they come inside this treasure looking um, chest thing. Well, she bought the chest hoping it'll be big enough to put all these in, but you know how, um, you know how some things work, isn't it? Online, sometimes it looks bigger, I mean smaller, I mean it looks bigger than it actually is, should I say. Oh, 
And she got me this really nice stack of tarot cards. This deck looks really cool. Because I do do my tarot reading, but I got like the easy tarots, the beginner's tarot. So I'm having like a second deck of tarot cards. It's actually really great. I do have to say, like with Temu, like they do have a lot on here. And like I do want to check out quite a bit. Because like some of these things that my mum got, I'm like, oh my god, that looks so brilliant. Anyway, so yeah pretty tarot card and then last but not least is this oh <sighs> okay so my mum uh, she was watching this youtuber me and my mum we watch this youtuber it's called she's called um life plus cindy and cindy is very very into her spirituality and everything like that and what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to have all your um crystals here it's basically meant to be a place where all your stones all your crystals go and whatever you the one that you need for that day sits on top of here like for example say if I don't know I need tiger eye that way or whatever like it sits on top of here and it's like honestly it's brilliant and then comes with like I think about eight of these sticky things to put on the wall it does feel very heavy though that's definitely solid it feels feels like good it feels like good quality I'm not gonna lie but yeah so that is that is my presents for my mum I'm actually going to put this up but first I need a cup of tea I actually decided to um, put it up now because I thought might as well. Soon, in like an hour and a half, we have to go and to be honest, I really want this up. So I'm just gonna stick these on. quickly because I don't want it to lose it sticky I'm just sticking these. We're sticking these. Sorry, I'm mumbling. Sometimes I forget that I have to talk extra clear because there's a camera. So when then when I go to edit and I watch it back, I'm like, what the hell am I trying? What the hell am I actually saying right now? <laughs> it's funny. What do you, what do we think over here? Maybe right here, isn't it? And I think we can have the very last one on the ferry itself. Right. Let's hang her up.
right, what do we think, guys? Uh, I think that looks beautiful. Like, the stones ain't even on it yet, and look how beautiful this looks. And then next to it, do more of what makes you happy. Like, honestly, it's like, I was even saying to my mum, but how it's almost like she gave me a survival kit for my 30s. You know, it's all spiritual stuff. And I love that. And what I love most is the fact that my mum, she's not into spirituality at all. She's not into meditating. She's not into yoga. She's not into crystals. She's not into hypnosis. She's not into spells. She's not into literally any of that. Yet still, she knows that I'm into it. And because she knows I'm into it, she supports She supports me on it. And she bought me all this stuff. Half this stuff, she didn't even know what it meant. But she bought it because she knew it'll be special to me so i think that's pretty special this is really nice um i do feel i do feel like um this is for like a pendulum i do think so i'm not too sure but honestly there's a brilliant there's a brilliant present i am very very happy about this and so I'm literally going to put um, the thing that all the stones that my mum bought, bought me, I'm going to put them, I think, on the long pier as a thank you. <laughs> these are really nice and you know what as much as you know it is a little sad that Sally couldn't make it I do feel like you know maybe maybe it's for the best in a way I took so long at the library looking for these stupid books and then um then obviously hanging this up and then I need to quickly have a shower before it's time for us to leave so yeah but i think i might have a bath only because oh, it's friday <laughs> all right i'm gonna show i'm gonna put all i'm gonna put the stones i'm gonna put the stone so pay attention <laughs> I'm putting the quartz up here. Right, so when you next see it, that is going to be full of stones. Because I do have a lot of stones. Obviously, I could put all my stones in here because obviously I got a lot, but I'm not too sure if I can pile them on top of each other. I did try, but they just kept slipping out and falling behind behind here, and so I don't know. But it looks pretty good, though, don't you think? I mean, it looks pretty good. I think what I might do is each month just swap out the stones for what I need basically like sort of like a healing thing what do you think like each month just switch these stones for new stones and yeah just keep it rotating that way to be honest i do need to charge them 
especially the well these two at the bottom because i had the ones that my mum bought and so obviously they're new they need charging so i'm gonna do that and then i'll put them back up there in the morning after they've been charging near the window and i'm also gonna charge the turret deck as well guys guess what so my brother he bought me these books Eat his joke presents because everyone knows that I like books and I always buy everyone books. So he bought uh, Mr. Greedy Eats Clean to Get Lean, <laughs> Mr. Happy and the Office Party, <laughs> and Little Miss Shy Goes Online Dating. <laughs> and they all have like this sign that says for grown ups. <laughs> Uh, you know what? I legit thought this says something else. Like, look at the bottom. I thought, am I the only one who thought that said something else? <laughs> and then my sister, she said it's part one of my present, but she bought me earrings. Oh. And they don't go green. And also, also, my um, brother, look what he bought me. Look, look, look. It's a Virgo bracelet. Oh, I am all Virgoed out today. <laughs> I'm sweaty. I feel like a puddle. For some reason, I'm drinking a hot chocolate. Don't ask me why. I don't know why. Uh, it's my birthday and I deserve chocolate. <laughs> hey, guys. So, I'm back from work. Um, my manager, he's so cute. He came in with this card and it even comes with, um, let me, let me actually get you the bag. It even comes with a badge. Um, obviously I wore my, I wore my badge, but it was like on my work t-shirt. So I'm just eating chocolate at the moment. Look, <laughs> come with a badge. Um, yeah, so it's basically like, Come with a badge, and everybody signed it. And he also got me a box of chocolate. So literally during the shift, me and Dominique were stuffing our faces, and then um, got home just sharing some chocolate with the family, etc. And um, what else? Also had a lovely conversation with my auntie. Shout out and. Yeah, pretty much. Um, I'm gonna go back anyway to talk to the fam, but I just thought I'll come in and say hi. Also, I forgot to uh, mention, sadly, when I came in, I saw that my, um, obviously I had put it on my wall before, my crystal holder. I saw it on my bed with all my crystals on it. So I was like, hmm? You know, did it drop? But then when I looked, the top part I like sort of like snapped off, so it must have dropped. And um, my brother probably heard it. I just picked it all up and put it on my bed. So my mum said that she's gonna try and fix it. So um, and then we're gonna try and because obviously the adhesive things that they gave with it obviously doesn't work properly. So yeah gonna sort that out because I really did love that I'm not gonna lie hey guys I'm just about to run a bath actually well it's run actually I just need to add my bubble bath I've already got my Epsom salts and my Dettol in there and I'm just literally tying up my hair um, to go in the bath honestly it's really weird because it's weird how like how quick my birthday went. You know, it went really quick, but I had a good day. My box of chocolates is finished. I had the last three. Um, we all had some though. All of us, I shared. Um, yeah. And so just trying to have a nice relaxing bath. I always like to um, tie my. I always like to tie my hair while I'm in the bath, just so that. Yeah, I mean, because my hair gets extremely fizzy, frizzy. 
So, how is your day? By the way, did I mention today is Friday? So I am super happy. I don't have to wake up for breakfast club. I mean, obviously you have to wake up. <coughs> Sorry. Wake up, basically do like a basic clean. And as I've had a deep clean last night, so just gonna do like a basically a basic clean and just basically choose what I'm gonna wear for I don't even I'm drifting between two outfits. Um I'm not too sure what I want to wear, I don't know. So we're gonna see anyway. So yeah, we're gonna see 